Hey guys, Ewan here, and in this video we have something very interesting, it's Patrick Moore, and how much muscle, how much weight did he gain from 2019 Mr. Olympia to 2021 California Pro? In this Instagram post right here that he posted one hour ago, he actually told us how much muscle he gained, how much weight he gained, or actually how much weight he lost in these two years, because he didn't gain anything, he is... 3 pounds lighter. In my previous video, I actually showed you this post of his where he asked us, what do we think, what is our guess, what is the weight difference? And here he used a photo where he's much closer to the camera, where he's got a better angle, where he looks 10 times bigger, and he asked us, what do we think, How? what is the weight difference? He didn't reveal it in the comments, and he waited a few days and then he gave us the answer, he was 3, three pounds lighter. When I talked about this in my video, I told you that the reason why he zoomed in the right photo so much was because the weight gain wasn't significant. I thought he was maybe 3 pounds heavier. I did not expect him to be 3 pounds lighter or even the same weight. I thought he was a little bit bigger, but not that much bigger and that's why he did this, he zoomed in the right photo. And I was kind of right, but honestly I'm surprised with this. 3 pounds lighter? Really? So here's what he said. I always like to be transparent with you guys, as I promised, the answer to the weight difference from 2019 Mr. Olympia to this past uh, California Pro is minus 3 pounds. Which is crazy to think about if you know what you're looking at in these two pics, bigger at lighter weight. Uh, try my best to scale them exact and at similar angles, I'm learning so much more about my body these days, which will help me to reach 100% eventually. Uh, as my brother Phil Heat puts it, you are only at 50% with a lot of work left to do. The path I'm on is much uh, different than a lot of guys striving to grow only where I need more tissue, not grow on the scale. Bigger isn't always better as quality will always be better than quantity. Back to work, he tags Melvin Anthony Jr. and he says clean muscle and also hashtags future, new blood, blah blah. So the question was after California Pro where he won, and before even, everybody was, if you talk about Patrick Moore, the main question was, will he be bigger, did he gain any weight? And my assessment, when I saw the video of California Pro, I said he's bigger, I think he was improved, I think he was better. Based on this photo right here, it's very hard to notice a difference. I mean, let's be honest, it's not some kind of crazy transformation, two years, I would expect him to be bigger but he doesn't want to add quantity, he wants to add a little muscle slowly, but yeah, he is bigger, I mean, if you take a look at only, if you, if you focus on his head, you will notice that the rest of his body is a little bit bigger, I would say his legs came up, and maybe his arms a little, but it's really hard to notice, he is not so much more, I mean, he is 3 pounds lighter, he is not really bigger, if you put it on scale, but yeah, his legs, his arms also, and also his back, it was very visible on the stage, you cannot really see it here, I'm gonna show it to you in a moment, but his back came up as well, so I think he probably gained some muscle in the back, and uh, a little bit in his, uh, in his legs and arms, but overall, not a lot, because I don't think he was conditioned, he, I don't think he was more conditioned at California Pro than he was at the Mr. Olympia, I think he was way more conditioned at the Mr. Olympia, and uh, I don't know how much sense does this make, did he really gain tissue, uh, because I don't think he lost any fat, I don't know, it's weird, he does look bigger, but the scale doesn't say that. This is 2019 Mr. Olympia, and he does look a little bit slimmer, so here he showed up super conditioned, he was probably the most conditioned guy on that stage, and he cracked the top 10, and everybody was like, if this guy brings up the size, if he comes bigger, he's gonna be hard to stop, he has a lot of potential, people were comparing him to young Ronnie, is he gonna be the next Ronnie Coleman, stuff like that, so we thought he's gonna get bigger next year, 2020 game, he was basically the same, just less conditioned. He did Mr. Olympia, and then Arnold happened in March, so he didn't really have an off-season, and of course he didn't grow, but he was not in same condition like before, People were very disappointed by him, they thought he's gonna make improvements, he's gonna be the next big thing. So he said on his social media that he's not gonna be competing until 2022, because that's how much time he needs to make improvements. He wasn't really congruent with his words, but still he had an off-season, he had a year to improve. And this was the end result, 2021 California Pro, where he won and was better.
Just take a look at his side chest pose. He does look bigger, his arms and his legs do look bigger. And from behind, also back, look at the lower back, he gained a lot of density in those lower lats, like, that's one of the best backs on the Mr. Olympia stage, honestly, the most complete backs. No, it's not as big as some of the other guys, but uh, as far as the detail and uh, the amount of mass, the density on his frame, it's quite a lot, I mean, there's a, a lot of details, a lot of mass, so he definitely improved the back. His glutes, though, were they as shredded as they were 2019? I don't think it was even close, look at his glutes right here, and hamstrings, and lower back, and everything, really, back, entire back, he has a good back, and he was ripped, 2019, and this was probably his best that he's gonna ever be at, I don't think he can get more conditioned than this, he tried a few times, it didn't happen, maybe it will happen at one point, I don't know, I hope so, but it might be his best version ever, 2019, and I still think it is today. Yes, he was bigger, a little bit bigger, 2021, but I like this conditioning a lot. Look at the glutes, I mean, look at the back, look at this. Conditioned, ripped to shreds. He was really peeled. And he was 3 pounds lighter 2 years later with probably a little bit worse conditioning. But he did look bigger and fuller, this side tricep, I love it. So, overall, I mean, I gotta say, he did look bigger on the stage. He did look a little bit bigger, but not more conditioned. How the hell was he 3 pounds lighter? I don't know. You guys explain it to me if you have any idea. Tell me down below your thoughts. Did, do you think he was bigger? Does he look bigger to you today than he looked 2 years ago? And how much muscle did he really gain? And how is this even possible? He does look a little bigger. And how is he lighter? I don't get it. If you guys have anything on your mind, just comment down below. Let's discuss this topic. Let's talk down below in the comment section. Like this video though if you enjoyed it. And if you want to see more bodybuilding videos like this, subscribe to my channel. All the best guys and bye-bye.